Now, I just grabbed all of the spices that I thought would go really well in a dish with pigeon. And I thought, why don't we do a traditional French dish called duck l'orange, but using those ingredients and using pigeon, but with all the Asian spices as well. First of all, I'm gonna make a glaze. Now that honey was orange blossom honey, just around a couple of tablespoons. Look at the color of it, just so clear. I'm gonna deglaze it with a bit of red wine vinegar, just a juice of one orange. And I've got orange zest just around a teaspoon or so. Now, whilst that's heating up, I've got some dry roasted spices. So just a teaspoon of the coriander seeds and this pepper I've never tried before. Maria let showed me this pepper. It's wild from Madagascar. The flavors in this just keep developing. It's spicy, it's sweet, and it's almost like a Sichuan pepper. Wonderful pepper, beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna just kind of pound that up into a nice powder some cinnamon. Now I've dry roasted these as well. Throw a couple in there. A couple of star anise. Oh, that's smelling good. Lovely. Now another little Asian ingredient, lemongrass. Actually, I find quite a lot of lemongrass through France, especially in Paris. I use it quite a lot. Grab my pestle and just bruise that as well. If you bruise your lemongrass, it just releases all of the wonderful aroma. I'm going to turn off the heat and just let it infuse there. Oh, if you can smell this right now. Now what I've done with the pigeon is I've cleaned it all out of course and I've blanched it in hot water, salty water, just for two minutes, just quickly. And I just let it dry so we'll get it nice and crispy when I roast it in the oven. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stuff my pigeon with a lovely gingerbread that we just cooked up. But what I did, I crumbled all the gingerbread, add a bit of water and I'm just making a nice little stuffing like that. I'm gonna stuff the cavity. Okay, perfect. Now I'm gonna just brown the skin just on medium heat, not too high. You don't want to burn the skin. Just for a few minutes on each side. Now I'm also going to add a little bit of butter just so I can baste the skin of the pigeon as it's browning. Beautiful. Just like that. Bonjour. Bonjour. You want to try? Oh, that's nice and brown now. Now I'm going to add just a little bit of water to the pan. Just gonna deglaze that slightly. And I'm gonna paint on all that beautiful glaze. Wonderful. I'm going to roast this 180 degrees for 20 minutes and it's done. Mimi! Oh! Smell good? Mm. Mm. I can smell your gingerbread, mm. huh? Yes. That's perfect. Look at the beautiful colour in there. And all the Asian spices. I'm going to lift the beautiful pigeon onto the plate. Wow. And I've got some of your cinnamon there, mm. yeah? Some star anise. Just going to get some beautiful spring onions there. This is working really, really well, actually. Okay, I'm going to get the lemongrass out as well. Garnish, bit of sauce. Mm -hmm. And your crumble yes. all around there. And I noticed you had some goji berries as yeah. well. I soaked the goji berries with a bit of grain money, yeah. Beautiful burst of color. Mm. And that's it. What do you think? Très beau, très beau. C'est magnifique. Magnifique, super. Glazed pigeon with mm. Asian spices. So how would you say this in French, Nami? Pigeon au pain d'épices. Pigeon au pain d'épices. Merci beaucoup. Thank you. Super. Perfect. Mm.